everybody, and I'm here with Abby Grandstaff. And do you want to tell us a little bit about yourself? Hi, my name is Abby. I'm a senior, and I'm the captain of the Streets and Debate team. All right, all very nice, very nice. Uh, to start off, what color would you describe speech and debate? Um, I would describe speech and debate as blue because Congress, and that's more of like the debate side of it. And I always think of like an American flag, so I just always see like blue. And also, I think I had like a blue folder or something like that, so I just see like blue. <laughs> very nice, <laughs> very nice color. I love blue. Uh, why Congress and why the debate team? Congress, I've always been interested in like politics and like foreign affairs and then with Congress we compete on bills that we write and a lot of it is about like what's happening in the world right now. So I get to learn about like everything that's happening, like politics, like foreign countries, like like national and also international events, which I think is really cool. And also we get to like argue with other people and like debate with other people about like bills we wrote and like research. So I think that's really cool. All right, that's nice. That's really some really cool things. What do you like most about speech and debate? Um, I think my favorite thing about speech and debate is especially the whole team aspect of it and how close we've gotten because, like, we've, like, prepped our speeches together and we practice and also, like, talk to each other about our events. So, like, seeing, like, the friendships I've made throughout the years, I think, is especially my favorite part. How long have you been on the team? I've been on the team since my sophomore year, so this is my third season competing. Nice. What was your first tournament like? Um, my first tournament, I was really, really scared because I felt like I was the youngest one there and everyone was like older than me and better than me. And it was so like intimidating, <laughs> but Stella, the captain at the time, calmed me down and she told me everything was okay. And then eventually, like, I built up skills and I got, like, to the spot where I wanted to be. Mm -hmm. So just, like, it takes time, but, like, it's very important that you, like, gradually, like, increase, like, competing, like, everything like that. All right. That's really nice. Do you think being on the debate team has enriched you? Yeah, I definitely think so. So even if it's, like, public speaking skills and also, like, learning about like everything that's happening in the world i really think that it's definitely enriched me uh do you have any upcoming tournaments yes so our next tournament is our state competition which is in april and it's april 28th and 29th so i'm really looking forward to that one nice go koalas uh <laughs> will you miss speech and debate Yes, I'm really going to miss it so much. And as I go to college next year, I'm really looking forward to it. But also, it's definitely a bittersweet moment because I'm excited to move on, but also I'm going to miss it. And I'm really looking forward to seeing the underclassmen really step up to the plate and really improve. And I'm really looking forward to that. All right. Thank you so much for being here today. And go Koalas!